And we begin here with that breaking news we've been following all afternoon from Washington, D.C., where we are learning that a U.S. Capitol Police officer is dead and a male suspect is dead as well. And we are now just learning who police say that suspect is. Multiple senior law enforcement officials confirming to NBC News that that person is Noah Green. He's a 25-year-old man from Indiana. And so he is believed to be this person who attacked at the U.S. Capitol today. Uh, we do know that police say that the suspect Green rammed into officers with a car, crashed into a Capitol barricade, and got out and lunged at officers with a knife. This according to law enforcement. As you can see here, we're taking a look at the investigation scene. This all started around 1 this afternoon. They say the suspect entered a north barricade of the Capitol, rammed those two officers, hit a barrier, got out of the car with a knife. Police say that officers tried to talk to him. The suspect lunged with a knife and officers fired. That suspect, Green, is dead. Once again, both officers going to the hospital, and sadly, one of them has passed. This has been an extremely difficult time for U.S. Capitol Police after the events of January 6th and now the events that have occurred here today. So I ask that you keep our U.S. Capitol Police family in your thoughts and prayers. Now, clearly a lot is still under investigation right now, but police this afternoon saying at this point, this does not appear to be terrorism. Certainly a lot to unpack here in just a few minutes. We're set to talk to Meet the Press moderator Chuck Todd, and no doubt he will probably discuss how this has been a rough time, as we just heard there from officers for this U.S. Capitol Police Force seeing yet another attack on their force.